Hey, welcome to American Whiskey Experience. How's it going? Pete? James? James? And we have a guest. We have a guest today. Another All the way from uh, Denver, Colorado. Actually, Golden, Colorado. Golden, Colorado, yes. Sir. Is where he's uh, the home of living now. Coors, the home of Coors, isn't it? The home of Coors, yes, yeah. it is. The home and of Coors. Showers. Coors. And showers. <laughs> That would be our studio audience right. talking when it says right. silence right. on the screen. Yeah. Exactly. Uh, it's, a pleasure, it's a pleasure to be here. Yeah. Yeah. Jay Panaroni, everyone. Thank you, thank you. Pleasure to be here. So, uh, hey, thanks for shoot, uh, tuning in to American Whiskey Experience, Facebook, YouTube, Instagram. Yeah. Tonight we are going to pour, um, let's pour the copper and cask. Yeah. This is a store pick. Copper and cask from, uh, store pick is out of uh, Milford Wines and More. Yeah. Right? Yep. And it is a, um, is, are, they, are they a blender out of, of Indiana? Uh, they're out of Lawrenceburg, Indiana. You are correct. Okay. Um, you know what? We try to Google, you some, know, some use stats. stats on this, and it was we couldn't find anything really. No. So Indiana kind of leads me to believe that it may be MVP. Yeah, I would think so. Um, Possible. You know, there was no website. There was no Instagram page. I mean, we could dig deeper, and we could probably find some more. Maybe but, um, Corey might have made it in the basement. Maybe. Although I did see this going around to other stores and okay. stuff. But right. this is a six-year. Yeah. So what's pretty cool about this pick from Corey at Wines and More is it's six-year. Everybody else that has this right now is a yeah, four-year four year pick. Four year. So I think he's the only one that yeah, picked up a six-year year. barrel. Yeah. Um, so you it's know, really cool. It's a six-year. It's fifty-six point seven percent alcohol. So we're gonna top that out at one thirteen and change. Yeah, yeah one thirteen point four proof. Mm. That's kind of what we like. Yeah, that's pretty good. Pretty what good. about you? What do you like your whiskeys at? High proof or low proof? I like a middle, middle of the road. Like hundred. Yeah. One thirteen is good. I feel like when you get up into the one twenties, like the other night, you were gonna pour me yeah. something that was like yeah. one twenty-six yeah. or something. Right. And it was the end of the night. We already been drinking. That's a little too much. Yeah. You know. So the mash bill on this, so it says 70% corn, 21% rye, and 9% malted barley. So obviously High corn. higher corn. Yeah. Um, it's so, a straight bourbon whiskey. So. so maybe we'll get some sweetness out of it yeah. maybe if it's corn. Yeah, no. Yeah. Cool bottle, though. Cool I do bottle. like the bottle. It reminds me of like an old-fashioned, like, yeah. Western-type bottle. You know, I, I like that style. The cork is nice. It's, it's actually, uh, it's not one of those, uh, you know. Synthetic? Synthetic. Well, it, part of it is. Part of it looks like it's wood. The bottom part is synthetic. But, um, I'm going to pour, you know. Pretty cool little logo on there. It's like a, what is that? The, uh, it's like a, one of those flying birds. What do you call those things? Pelican. <laughs> a flying bird with, with, with claws. As, eagle? as, a, as, a, as opposed eagle. to a yeah, non-flying bird. It is. It's a, it's, it might be a phoenix. Or it a might bird. be some kind of phoenix, right? Yeah. It's pretty cool though. Or is it a griffin? Is it called a griffin? That's a what I was going to say, griffin. Yeah. Peter yeah. griffin. Yeah. Peter yeah. griffin. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. No, wrong, wrong bird. Wrong show. Uh, again, so, uh, Copper, Copper gas, gas. straight bourbon whiskey, not Indian. Always ran, never ordinary is their slogan. So, so let's uh, take a look at. Were the you suggest? Did they suggest this to you at the liquor store you go to? Uh, you know, so I, I knew uh, another store uh, gave me a little flyer on it. Said, hey, we're gonna be carrying this soon, and we're yep. gonna carry the four year. And I was like, cool. And then you know, I didn't hear anything about it. It's been months and months, and then. Uh, Corey posted it on uh, the, the page that you know we follow and, and the email list that we are on, and um, you know I was definitely excited to look for this. And you know, I tell you, every pick that he's picked so far has yeah. been a hit. So, um, Where, I, who is this Corey out of where? Wines and more down in Milford. Milford. Okay. Yeah, yeah, the Boston Post Road, um, farther end of Boston Post Road. I yeah, Boston Post Road. Yeah. Um, they've been there forever and towards like the mall. Almost, almost near Milford Hospital, like that, actually. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay, yeah. okay. So, yeah. Uh, yeah, it's been a while since you've been in that area, so you probably don't know exactly yeah. what it is, but yeah. Yeah, lots changed in that area. Um, okay, so let's let's talk color yeah. real quick. So, like the name, it's got yeah. a nice bright copper. It does. Mm -hmm. I'll tell you that. I, I'll tell you, it matches, the, yeah, it matches their label pretty good, so. Yeah, uh, right. Copper and cast. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, the color is awesome. Um... Definitely copper. You know, spinning on the glass, you get those little legs on yeah. there, right? So it's no, definitely... glass pretty nice. Yeah. Even on the light, it's still got that great color. Um, I'm going to give it a little spin and a taste. Well, uh, I'm going to go with the nose first, yeah. actually. It's been a while right. since we've done reviews. I'm not drinking, just drinking. I just want to drink it. Not every time we get someone from Colorado to come out and drink with us. Right. I definitely get some sweet from the corn. I get corn, I get like syrupy sweet though. Yeah, right, like, it's uh, gonna be weird, but I get. It's alright. I get, I get. There's no 
fresh, wrong answer. Fresh but... package of tennis balls when you open the tennis balls. Wow. Okay. I don't I play tennis. Play, I know the smell, but yeah, wow. The smell. Really? Well, I mean, I, you know, I definitely get some dryness from the oak, from aged, aged oak. Yeah. But the sweet, I kind of get like. So, um, do you ruined it with the tennis ball thing. I don't know. Have you ever I opened it? Like it's no. like that fresh. It goes. I know. I know. It pops open. When we're done like, with this, we're all gonna drive to Dick's Sporting Goods and we're gonna we'll start opening up we'll tennis we'll balls. Did we'll somebody say Dick's? Yeah. There you go. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> no. Don't take long, does it? Yeah. No. I guess we're not. This is not gonna be for kids. This video. Right. No. So uh, I, I definitely get, I get a little sweetness. Um, I definitely get some some aged oak. I get raisin. You know, I get yeah. I don't get well, raisin. Yeah, I get. I can see sweet like uh, like fig or date, yeah, something like, like that. Yeah. I get brand. I get like raisin brand is what I get. That's okay. what I'm getting. I'm getting right. raisin brand. Okay, I could see the grain a little bit, a little bit of grain. Uh, yeah, but I, but I'm, for me, I think it's more of a. Uh, I'm not getting a lot of vanilla though. Or no, like no. That. the standard, you know, DNA. Maybe, this, of maybe a... the smell I'm getting for the tennis balls is like fresh grass, like I don't fresh oh, cut grass, go. okay, like that kind of like that could be true. About like summertime grass is scorched dry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. All right, let's All right. take a well, sip. I've smelled it enough. I gotta taste it. Hey, cheers, cheers, guys. Cheers. Thanks for having me. Uh, we'll see. <laughs> 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 we'll hold judgment on that one. Keep up those tennis ball fucking things, mm -hmm. you know. Well, it drinks high, I, 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 but not not burning high. But it, you, you feel it in that first little sip. No, I uh, I think what for for me I, it doesn't drink high. I think I get a lot of that dryness, a lot of that that oak tannins. Yeah, maybe that's what it was. Uh, the sweetness didn't translate for me. I get the vanilla that you didn't smell. Um, you getting the vanilla? I get vanilla in the taste that I didn't smell. See, I'm getting that fig again, that raisin a little bit. No sweetness, yeah, I definitely get some sweet, sweet fruit. Yep. Mm -hmm. um, hmm. But to me, it's more like um, like date fig. Yeah, I, I thought because it's 70% corn, mm -hmm. I thought because it's 70% corn, I would get a little more sweetness out of it. I'm not. That 21% rise kicking in for me. Well, I get some spice, some nice spice in the back of my, my tongue. Yeah. Uh, where I get some of that peppery. Mm -hmm. um, pepper. Definitely pepper. Uh, it's almost a white pepper. Red pepper. White yeah, pepper. I was gonna say it's not black pepper. No, it's just not. Uh -huh. It's a different. And that's a little bit translate. Like I said, with the oak can. Dry too. Yeah, dry dryness. Oak. But I do have an underlying of the sweetness. I feel like there's a caramel. You know, there's like caramely in my mouth. You know, I, I'm getting vanilla. I'm getting mm -hmm. a little sweet. You know. Oh, yeah. As it mellows out. I think it, with the. I think. I'm sorry. Go ahead. Uh, well, as it mellows out, like the first. Obviously, it's like that first hit is like the peppery, the spicy, the the alcohol, the burn, and then as it mellows out, I feel like I feel the vanilla and the caramel. I think it's one of those things like your palate adjusts to it, the more yeah. you sip on it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, now, it's like, I, I still get a little, I can, I can see a little vanilla. Yeah. I can see a little bit, almost like, uh, mm. I, I still get the dry fruits. <clears throat> I got more oak in the, the well, nose than in the, the taste. Than the, than the well, mouth. I get the oak in the finish, so I get the dryness, I get the white pepper, uh, really at the end of it, yeah, a little okay. spice at the end, that's kind of where that comes in. I think it's very good. What do, yeah. what do you get on the finish? Like, do you feel like hugging you still? You no, know, I feel like it mellows out. I'm, get, I'm getting the white pepper and the oak on the taste. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then as it finishes out, it rounds around my tongue and becomes more. Van I get, I'm getting more sweet, more vanilla and caramel as it mellows out. With seventy percent corn, you're gonna. I think you, the sweet will translate. Yeah. But, but I'm surprised yeah. it's not a little sweeter. I'm getting a little bit of like a. Like a mocha chocolate, like a dry mocha chocolate. Like licorice chocolate. Yeah, on on the on the back end. Okay. Um, is it mocha chocolate? Is it mocha? It's a little redundant. Now. No, it's like mocha it's chocolate. Like mocha, mocha is mocha chocolate. Like mocha. Uh, I thought mocha. Like it's like a Starbucks mocha. Okay. Type. Uh, no, not for me. Yeah, that's what I'm getting. No. You get coffee. You get a coffee? I'm not getting like a coffee, like a black coffee or something, like a flavored coffee maybe, like a like, like a, a mocha. latte. Like a mocha latte. <laughs> oh, there you go. Something to that effect. There's, there's something. Um, With the dryness, I can get some leather too. Yeah, yeah the leatherness is there. Um, sure. I was, I was going to bring that up. Right. Um, you know, hey, I mean. So what's the price point on this? I forgot to ask you. You know. Do you remember? Yeah. I, I, you forgot. Somewhere between sixty to seventy dollars. I don't think it was more than sixty-five, but um, okay. you know, I know the four years were going for a little less, but again, this is a six-year. It's a higher proof. I don't, I don't know what the the four years proof was. 
Um, I don't know. But I, I'm, I'm sure you're getting more flavor on this than a four year. And I'll, I'm going to try to find the four year and do a, you know, we'll do a side by side comparison. It's just a good. test. Um, it's a long finish for me. It is. I, I don't know if I would pour this multiple times in one night. It's a good starter with some friends like tonight and right. then go to something else. Um, it's not heavy where, I, no, that's not the reason why I wouldn't want to keep drinking it throughout the night. I just think it's the proof. Eventually, it's going to kick in and be like, wow, wait a I minute. I don't think it did, did we realize, did we find out where is it from? It was it Indiana, Indiana, but Indiana? Lawrence Park, okay. Indiana. But okay. we're not sure if they source their product from, you know, somewhere. Right, sure, sure. Based sure. off the area, the fact that we couldn't find anything online about them, um, I would think, like, you would think MGP. MGP which I'm, is, I'm thinking, I'm, I'm, I'm more wondering where they're from because I'm wondering where it would be available. I wonder if I could get it in Colorado. Oh, right. right. You know, um, I mean... Shoot, I mean, if you get in Connecticut, you probably get in Colorado. I mean, yeah. the, the, the the laws here are tougher yeah. to get, you know, distributors yeah. come here, yeah. the cost with taxes and fees and stuff like that. So I'm sure you might be able to. Um, yeah, take a look, see if you can find it. Uh, we're going to do some more searching on this because, again, we want to get the four year and see what's going on. Put your nose back in that glass. Uh, yeah, smell that glass, empty it, drink it. Once you're done with it, I get a little cigar box now. Oh, the yeah. empty glass. Smell that now. Get that? Old yeah. box, cigar box. Boy. Right? I get that little zest where it makes you want to sneeze. It tickles the nose. I bet you if you let this glass sit for another 10 minutes or so, yeah. you're going to get that dryness and that you're going to get that I always like, I'll tell you, I, it always enjoy, when, I pour, when I pour a whiskey that I can, the more I sip on it and the longer I, I enjoy it for, the more it comes out. Yeah. I, and the deeper layers that come out in it, that's really very interesting to me. Yeah. So like something like this, where like initially it took a little bit, my palate kind of adjusted. Uh, the more I sip on it, the more I kind of dig, dig deep. Right. That, that's enjoyable. Like you can pour yourself a glass of it, sit on it for a while, and really, really, uh, really enjoy it. Hello. Well, listen. It's I like mean, watching a movie over and over again and seeing new things. New things pop up. Yeah. You know, yeah. You know, yeah. Oh Basically. shit! I never. I watched this movie for twenty years. I never saw that. Right. Well, that is the American whiskey experience. It, it is, and you know we do love our barrel-proof whiskeys. So uh, you know nothing's better than from the barrel to the yeah. to the bottle to our glass here at American Whiskey Experience. Yeah. Um, all right, we're, we're gonna end this one now for yeah. you, and um, you know stay tuned for some other videos that we'll be uh, releasing in the future. Yeah. Uh, Check out it's out. great to be back. Yeah, it is. You know? It is. So yeah. uh, we got a lot it's of bottles to go through. Yeah, it has been a long time. Um, so, hey, again, thanks for showing up uh, and following us again. Yeah, appreciate Pete, it. Where, where are we located? Where, where can you find us? Where can you find us? On, on uh, Instagram, Facebook, YouTube. Yeah. And what's that thing called that you maybe want to do? I think we might do TikTok. We might do a little couple little, little quick little, you know. I have no idea what that is. For the, for the for 21 kids. year olds, you know? It's teenage girls dancing, I think, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's. Well, I'm, I'm still pushing for them to do OnlyFans. And, <laughs> and, and I'm not dancing. Well, there's a fee. You gotta pay for that, right? Yeah, I don't yeah, think yeah. anyone wants to pay for no this. No one's paying to look at us. These are free. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Again, hey, thanks a lot. Thanks a lot. Hey, Jay, man. Thanks, thanks for, for you know coming, flying thank out you. tonight Cheers for this. Thank you. Thank you. Cool. Yeah. You know, his Absolutely. jet is waiting for him, so he's gonna have yeah. to leave. Private yep. jet. Yeah. Yep. 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 Uh, so hey, I appreciate everything and thanks. So cool. Again, thanks a lot. Thanks for our audience, and uh, we'll see you again soon. Take thanks. Care. Take care. Bye.